Hello, it's Sarah. This is Ginny. She is my son's dog. She doesn't stand still very much. And there's Kirby. And Ginny has been here since Thursday. He went to Vegas. And it's, it's a lot. She's two. She is a standard poodle. Hi, Jen. And she's a love. She is. She's a love. But my God, compared to Kirby, listen to the way she breathes. The hyperness. Jenny, why are you so excited? Oh, my God. So I wanted to show you my, this is where I've been sewing. And she just threw a toy behind me. Thanks. Tripping me, are you? Um, and it's my dining room. Um, and I've been accumulating things. So I think I'm going to just share what I've been up to. I'm going to walk over. I have my camera on a small tripod today. I'm going to set it on the table and see if I can. I don't really want to show you the windows because I don't know if that's. Okay, that's good. <clears throat> that, let me show you. So these two bins are some of the jelly rolls that I've gotten because this whole table was just covered in fabric. It was just so chaotic. And then this bin, I put my fat quarters um, and then this is all the batiks that I had that I was going to do the um, uh, applique with. So that makes me feel better. This is just an old tin that I've had. Um, I'm just putting this on this chair. I don't know. I think it was my mom's. And it has like little like thread, pins, elastic, buttons, zippers, scissors. What are these called? These are pinking shears. Um, any random stuff like that because I was basically keeping everything for sewing in this. This is like a, a tote that I made and I don't even know. I wish I'm going to look for the um, pattern because it must have been a pattern. And I mean, it's not horrible. And um, but I made it years ago, so I don't remember much about it, but I just have very little in here now, mainly my quilting foot, my feet, and th some thread. So um, this is just scraps. Actually, this is my Tim Holtz fabric. Hopefully you can hear me okay, because I know I'm not as close to the camera as usual. And I still have plenty of that left. I have, uh, I got a jelly roll from fabric.com. I actually got it from Amazon and it was 25 bucks, but I'm really, I'm going to show you what I made with it so far. My Tim Holtz fabric. I think it's called e Eclectic Elements and it's, there's some menagerie in there. It's just, it seems like it's just a lot of his, um, earlier fabrics. I'm just going to, this is my little pin, pin book. What are they called? I don't know. Alright, and then this is just scraps. So I've got it somewhat organized. This is just my gotta have your sewing manual at hand. So I keep that near the machine. Um, and then I just bought another pillow form today. What did I step on? A window thing. I just bought a pillow form today. Um, Making, gonna make, I'm making Maya a rag quilt. Maya's birthday is this month, the 26th. And I'll show you what I got for that. But this is my, the pillow I made. This is for my craft room, and I'm loving it. I ended up switching out the other pillow cover that I made for this one. And I love it, because this, the reds in that are pretty, they're kind of closer to burgundy than they are to red. The, I mean, the red writing one is very red. But I think it it's it plays. It's really cute. I didn't put a binding on it. I just ended up stitching the back and then flipping it inside out. So, but I love it. I'm I'm happy. Like I like that now for my craft room. I'm happy with that. And then I made this, which is see. I don't know if I can put the camera down. Oh, I can. 
This is just a book cover and I just quilted as I go went, quilted as I go um, in the strips because the fabric I bought was in strips. So I just made this. And I mean, it's a little wonky for some reason. My, um, my, my binding came out a little, eh, it's okay. And I might, I may put these in my Etsy store. I got to get moving on that. But like these dogs, are you chill now? Because you know why? Where's Kirby? Why are you so chill? Oh, there's Kirby. Hi. Uh-oh. I shouldn't have spoken because you should see when they start playing. Oh, my gosh. It's insane. So my husband made all this stuff for me to block them off. Like, he made this gate, like, out of <laughs> scraps. And so we, at night, we have that cordoned off because he couldn't fit her crate in his car. So he didn't realize that because he had gotten a new car since he brought her last time and so we don't have a crate for her so we're just we block off the kitchen but see look look what she does like Kirby's probably laying on the floor right now look she follows her around and just stares at her. but look at the size difference Jenny leave her alone because man when they go at it oh boy those paws Jenny's paws are bigger than Kirby's body so anyway, it's it's a lot. Look, she just stalks her. She won't leave her alone. She wants to play. Kirby's being very good. Kirby, you're being a good girl. You're being a good girl, Kirby. I'm not going to get that. But anyway, I'll go back in here. Oh, you know what? I'll take you in um, my craft room and show you. Oh, no, let me finish showing you what I'm doing for um, Maya. So let's see if I can do this. So these are, this is going to be Maya's, let me turn this so I can see what I'm shooting. This is going to be Maya's rag quilt. And I made it with all flannel. And I actually ran out, of course. Oh, now you can't see it. But it's basically 8 inch blocks that are stitched. So you stitch them back to back. So this is a block. Here, let me try to shoot it like this. That's my machine. I have a Janome machine. So this is a block. The whole back is this pink fabric. This is um, flannel, Joanne's flannel, and it's very nice. Um, so you just cut everything into eight inch blocks and then you just, and you can stitch as many um, pieces together as you want of flannel and it makes it more ruffly the more pieces you have. So you just cut out eight inch blocks all over the place and I backed every single one with this pink and this one just has like cute words faith joy love believe all that stuff um, and then you just use and I'm using a one inch seam allowance so they're basically then they're going to turn into six inch blocks right I don't really know but then it's like six inch blocks so I ran out of backing fabric because I'm very new to this and um so I just went and got more today, and then I, now I have to wash it first. But this is the fabrics I used. They're so cute. So I have this one. It has just flowers and butterflies. Very, um, very much mixed media looking flowers, right? Um, just a white with pink polka dots. Um, this color I love. This color blue with all the different colors. The same colors that are in this. And they're all come then to find out. I mean, I didn't pick them that way, but they're all Joann's fabric, so I think they were meant to go together. And then the one with the words. And then the pink. So then I ended up using this one as the fifth. So I only picked five blocks, five colors, and then I'm just <clears throat> alternating them, so it's going to be a stripe. I'll come back and do a complete um, share when it's done. And it's, it's very time consuming because I ended up buying these um, shears because when you rag the fabric, <clears throat> you have to cut it like this to make it, when it, and then when you wash it, it's all going to fray and become fluffy. 
So we'll see. Let me see if this is actually coming out to be a six inch square. Just about. So yeah, so I'm doing pretty good. I'm getting, yep, they're looking good. Um, I got myself this new mat, which is a big one. This is 36 by 24. Um, because the one I was using, I have one for my desk that's my at my crafting table, but I wanted that one. This one's just, Jenny, seriously, that's Kirby's toy. What are you doing? Yeah, well, I'm not playing right now. <laughs> it's just a lot, you guys. I'm, I'm just, you know, I'm used to doing what I do. I'm not entertaining you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, it has like a big, see this is how big it is. It covers the whole end of the dining room table. So right now, I mean, I definitely am having thoughts of <laughs> redoing this room. This china cabinet is, oops, sorry guys, I don't know how to work this thing, <clears throat> is filled with my mom's china. And I don't use it, and I loved my mom very, very much, but I don't use it. And I don't really, it's dusty, and you know, I'm thinking that would be a great storage area for sewing stuff. <laughs> or sell that and then get a different kind of hutch, you know? I mean, I'm just saying, it would be great. Um, because I do think that sewing is something, I am definitely kind of liking it. Not that I'll be doing it for much longer, you know, I'll be switching back to something else in a minute, but I'm gonna walk in, oh, Kirby's back. Hello, Kirby. Kirby, are you okay? She's a lot, I know. Here, she's a nut. Um, what else did I want to show you in here before I go? Um, I, I'm going to make Maya a pillow cover too, just like this. I think I'm going to do a square one, maybe bigger squares. I think I'm going to make it with bigger squares, yeah. And um, I'm going to use the pink fabric for the backing. So that'll be a cushy little cover for her. See, look, she's nuts. Jenny, stop. Come on. So I'm just gonna walk through here. This is where my craft room is over here. And this is my chair. And here's where my pillow goes. But I like it, look. Doesn't it? It looks <clears throat> better than that other very, very, very colorful one did. I like it. Crazy dog. And of course it's an ode, an ode to Tim Holtz. And I kind of wish I put a binding on it, but I didn't really have any um, fabric. I could have just made a strippy, yeah. So maybe I'll make another one. I have plenty of fabric, you know, and it's all good practice. So, all right, you guys, see, look at her. So this is what I'm dealing with. That's why I can't, what are you doing? Jenny? What are you doing? What are you, Jenny? <sighs> Jenny, what are you, <laughs> what the frick are you doing? Look at Kirby, she just sits there like, you're nuts, dog. You're nuts. Kirby's four. And my God, I don't know how long puppyhood lasts. But Jenny is only two. Oh my God, she's crazy. Hey, would you ch just chillax? It's too hot. I got all the fans going in here and the, thank God for air conditioning. Those of you who don't have air, God bless you because it's a heat wave. I think she hears my voice. And oh God, no, Kirby, don't do it. Good girl, good, oh boy. When the bucket's in the air, you know she's gonna go. Kirby, just stay up there. Oh my God. <gasps> she's gonna bite you, Jenny. Jenny. So this is what I do all day, I referee. And luckily, say look, Kirby, stop. Get, I'm gonna lock you back in the back room, come on. Come here, Jenny, come. I want to show you something, Jen. Oh, there's Matt. Hello. Hello, but look, 
Come on, Jen. Come back here, Bubby. Look, come. Jenny, come. Jenny, come. There she is. Come, Jenny. Look at this. Look over here. See, she knows. Because I can close those doors and she just sits there like. Come here, Jen, Jen. I want to show you something. <gasps> Look at this, Jenny. Oh, she's, she's smart. Poodles are smart. Come here, Jen. Come here, honey. Look, there's your baby. Where's your baby? Jenny? Oh, you little shit. Jenny, here's your baby. <gasps> get your baby. Go get, oh, Jesus. So this is what I've been dealing with. Sorry for. It's getting me to the trash. Oh, come here. Come in here and get your baby. Come here. Come get this baby. <gasps> oh, let me have this baby. Come here, Jen. Jenny, here. Here, come get her. Oh, here she, oh, you little, my God. But anyway, I would just pull her by the collar and get her in here. And then there's my birdie. Hi, Kiwi. Come on. It's a crazy house, right? It's a menagerie. It's a menagerie. Jenny, is this the bird? She's going to bite you too. Everybody's going to bite you. Everybody's going to bite you, Jenny. <laughs> All right. Unbelievable. All right, let me put the bird back because I think I can actually, she doesn't want to go. All right, on my shoulder. All right, Jen. No, 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 no. Aha. Ah, so that's why I can't make videos because my dog, dogs, sorry, Matt. But see, she just, now when Kirby's in there, Kirby will just start bouncing on the door, just bouncing, bouncing with her paws. Oh, Jesus, hope. But Jenny just sits there and looks, so thank God, because Kirby will just be bounce on the door and knock it, knock it, knock it. So that's how I take a break. All right, you guys. Well, hopefully I'll be back with a video tutorial, something crafty, but I'm going to be sewing. Like, I'm exhausted. I'm exhausted okay. from that. Thank you, Matt. Okay. I'm exhausted, but... I have to wash all that fabric. I have just bought another uh, yard of each. Wash it all, iron it, then cut. I, I need, I ran out of the pink, so I basically need backs for all these. Stitch them together, and then I can start putting the quilt together. Um, and maybe I'll film a little bit of that. I know a lot of you guys don't sew, but, you know, what the heck. I'll show you what I'm learning. All right? So that's it. I hope that wasn't too crazy. I think I'm going to post it though. My goodness. <laughs> thanks you guys. And listen, keep cool. It's a hot, hot time out there. And thanks for watching.